Mr. Garwal, good morning. Thanks so much for giving us your time on ET. Now, to start with, you know, just to give our viewers a gist of what exactly your expansion plan entails. Yeah, good morning. So, uh, the current expansion plan is uh, in the series of uh, growth initiatives that we have taken for the company. It's uh, the main driver essentially is the data growth and the global fiber optic demand that we are seeing. And we have an increased presence globally. So last year in May, we took a decision to expand our optical fiber capacity to go from 30 million to 50 million kilometers uh, at a total capex of almost about 1200 crores. We uh, earlier this summer, we acquired uh, a company in Europe, uh, which was an optical fiber cable company. And the current decision essentially is to uh, is to expand the downstream product, which is the optical fiber cable. So with this fiber expansion and cable expansion, we uh, would have close to about eight to nine percent of global market share uh, of the overall optical fiber industry. And uh, all these measures are uh, uh, isolated measures, but part of a consolidated strategy towards reaching that uh, reaching that goal. Okay, that sounds very impressive. Just a clarification here, you mentioned 8 to 9% of the global market share. That would also include your acquisition um, in, uh, you know, Metallurgica that you made, including the uh, fiber optic, uh, you know, capacity that has gotten added with that acquisition. Including that, you'll be reaching about 8 to 9% of global market share? Uh, it's not 89, but 8 to 9%. So closer eight to about 9% 9. 9 of the global market share, yeah. Oh, yeah, I, I said 8 to 9. Uh, I think you may have misheard oh, me. 8 sorry. to 9%. No problem. All right. Oh, um, yeah. Let's talk about the expansion that, that you have planned. Um, from what I understand, uh, analysts believe that already what was announced by you was about 5 million uh, fiber kilometers from FY20 onwards. However, there's an additional uh, uh, 10 um, uh, fiber kilometers capacity from the first quarter of FY21 that has been announced by you. I think that was additional. That was unexpected. So in total, what would be the capex you'll be putting in for all of this expansion? And I mean, how phased will it be? By when will all of this come in, you know, be commissioned by you? Sure. Uh so uh, one part of the capex which uh, we are doing is expanding the fiber capacity from 30 to 50 million that is currently going on and it will be finished by june of 2019 this current announcement is about a smaller investment about 300 crores and that will start almost from now but will go on till june 2020 so we are having two macro investments one is in the phase of finishing by fy20 and the other one which will be peaking in FY21. So we have planned all the investments so that uh, it aligns with the cash flow, the internal accruals and the, and the balance sheet strength that we would have uh, as a company. Okay, and what's the, um, uh, you know, the amount you'd have to put in uh, for all of this investment? Uh, this is uh, 12 plus 3, about 1500 crores we are putting in as organic uh, capital investments. Uh, that's uh, other than the uh, about four, uh, 450 crores or so we spent for the acquisition. So in totality, close to 2,000 crores, but over a period of uh, almost four years. Mr. Garwal, just before I thank you, um, I think uh, during Q1 FY19, the utilization of your existing uh, OFC capacity had improved to more than 90%. Um, by the end of FY19, what will your capacity be and also what will the approximate utilization levels be? By the end of FY19, we'll be closer to 18 million uh, capacity and we should be pretty, we're running very close to 100% utilization, which prompted us to take this decision. So uh, the capacity of 15 with addition of Metallurgica becomes 18 and we are running uh, now as well as towards the end of 19 by almost uh, close to 100% utilization. All right. Okay, Mr. Garwal, uh, we leave it at that. Thanks so much for joining in on ET Now. Thank Explain. You.